top 10 places to visit in Australia. When we hear Australia, we think about the rich natural beauty, kangaroos, beaches, and the vast outback. But do you know if we do a one-day visit to all of the beaches in Australia? It will take 28 years to visit them all. Yes, Australia is homing that many beaches. Australia is a vast country with many diverse landscapes and experiences to be had. From the Great Barrier Reef to Uluru, it's easy to see why Australia is one of the top places to visit in the world. Hello to our adventurous community. Welcome to today's fun trip on top 10 places to visit in Australia. Before moving on to our video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification to bring you updates about future exciting videos like this. Now without any further ado, let's get into it. Number 1. Melbourne Flinders Street Railway Station was the first railway station in Australia, and it wasn't long before it became the most crowded station on the planet. It attracts a large crowd, making it one of the best tourist attractions. Next is Queen Victoria Market, popularly called Queen Vic or Vic Market. It is a major attraction in the heart of Melbourne and stretches across two city blocks. An exciting and lively marketplace that is a perfect spot to bring out your shopping spree with more than 600 small stores selling everything from fresh vegetables, fruits, local imported epicure food, souvenirs and clothes. Another popular spot is Federation Square or Fed Square. It is Melbourne's leading hub of significant cultural attractions and world-class events. It is located opposite Flinders Street Station, and it is one of the best tourist places in Melbourne. No matter if you are a sports fan or not, you should once visit the Melbourne Cricket Stadium, the magnificent sporting venue in Australia. Number 2. Sydney The Sydney Opera House is a World Heritage Site and one of the most famous buildings in the world. It's also one of Australia's top tourist attractions, being used as a venue for events such as concerts, performances and parties. The Sydney Harbour Bridge is one of the world's most recognizable landmarks. Not only is it the largest steel arch bridge on the planet, but it also spans one of the globe's finest natural harbours. The iconic bridge took eight years to build and opened in 1932. It's made of 53,000 tons of steel and 6 million hand-driven rivets. Bondi Beach is another spectacle for tourists, surfers and sun soakers, and it's become a real attraction for young backpackers in particular. If you are also a seeker of bright feelings, you can try to get surfing lessons and just have fun. The Blue Mountains are a world heritage site and are famous for their wildflowers, bushwalking trails, and aboriginal rock art. They're also home to the Sydney Opera House, a famous landmark that makes for great photos. Number 3. Perth Perth is one of the most isolated capital cities on the planet. It is located on the western coast. It is one of the fastest growing cities in Australia and is popular for its laid-back lifestyle, beautiful beaches, and sunny skies. While you are here, you can cruise along the Swan River to the shores of the Swan Valley. This place is a heaven for beach lovers by housing several beautiful beaches. Not far from the city center is Cottesloe, one of Perth's popular beaches. It is famous for its clear water and cafe culture. Another beautiful beach located here is Rockingham Beach. After the sun time, enjoy the hotspot for Perth nightlife Elizabeth Key. It was named after Queen Elizabeth Prime, too. This place exhibits some amazingly innovative architecture. The curves of the bridge seem to follow the flow of the water around it. Number 4. Cairns, Queensland If you're looking for both adventure and beauty in a place, the Great Barrier Reef is here to offer it. This reef is the world's largest coral reef system, covering 2,300 meters of the coast and is UNESCO World Heritage Site. It is one of the world's greatest natural phenomena. There are more than 400 species of fish living in it, and there are also 30 or so whales and dolphins that call this part of the world home as well. The Daintree Rainforest has been growing creeping vines and emerald canopy for more than 180 million years. That's right, it's the world's oldest tropical rainforest by an impressive 10 million years, so it's no wonder that visitors can feel the ancient energy with every step. It is also one of Australia's most popular tourist destinations, with many tourists making it their first stop when they arrive in Australia. Number 5. Tasmania 
Tasmania is a delight for foodies and nature lovers. Its capital, Hobart, has transformed itself into a hub of cutting-edge culture. Its beautiful setting between the sea and the soaring peak of Cunnany or Mount Wellington has inspired many of its talented artists in all genres. So, visiting the Tasmanian Art and Music Gallery is a must. The city's waterfront area is filled with hip cafes and restaurants, where foodies will find a lot to fall in love with. You can eat around the world on the restaurant strip in North Hobart. The jewel in the crown of the state's many natural wonders is Cradle Mountain Lakes and Clare National Park. Hiking there is legendary. Favorite day walks include the Lake Dove Walk, with magnificent views of Cradle Mountain. If you're wondering what to do in Tasmania for a week, a hiking trip here could more than fill your days. Number 6. Gold Coast, Queensland The Gold Coast is Australia's one of the most famous vacation destinations. Surfer's Paradise is the tourist hub of this glamorous coastal strip. Packed with a ton of skylines as high as a kite, rocking nightclubs, hip restaurants, an enormous beach with groovy waves and more this place is truly a paradise, not just for the surfers but for every holiday maker, and this is one of the best places to visit in Gold Coast. Another attraction that lures tourists to Gold Coast is Kerman Wildlife Sanctuary. It is not less than a heaven for nature and wildlife enthusiasts. It is a non-profit organization where you can spot a variety of birds, reptiles, insects and mammals. The best thing here is that you can have an interactive session with birds and animals that you haven't even heard of before. Number 7. Darwin Darwin is literally a tropical paradise of Australia. When you hear about people crocodiles, Northern Territory is the first place that would come to mind for most Australians. Crocosaurus Cove offers the fearsome cage of death experience, where the only thing keeping you from becoming crocodile food is the cage you're inside of as it is lowered into croc-infested waters. Sounds thrilling enough? You can chill out at the Wave Lagoon, a wave pool, with waves that go up to 1.7 meters at their highest. Feast your eyes and mind at the Museum and Art Gallery of the Northern Territory. Cruise the Mary River wetlands and stroll through Darwin Botanic Gardens. Number 8. Brisbane, Queensland Brisbane is the third largest city in Australia. One of the coolest venues in town is Brisbane Powerhouse. Formerly an abandoned power station, it now houses all kinds of different cultural events, with something new going on every day. The Wheel of Brisbane, towering to a height of 60 meters, boasts incredible views of the city and the river below. It looks particularly arresting in the evening, when it is beautifully lit up against the night sky. A visit to Brisbane can never be complete without stopping by the Lone Pine Koala Sanctuary. It is home to all kinds of Aussie critters, with koalas and kangaroos on show, besides learning all about them. You can also feed kangaroos, pose for a photo with a koala, or be a keeper for a day. Number 9. Uluru Uluru, also known as Ayers Rock, is a large sandstone rock formation in Australia located in the heart of the Red Centre. It is sacred to the Anangu people, who believe it is their spiritual home and that they have lived there since time immemorial. The place where you find yourself standing on top of this massive monolith feels otherworldly, and it should. The red-coloured sand structure has been a witness to many important events throughout history, including those involving Aboriginal culture, European settlement, and tourism. It's located about two hours' drive south of Alice Springs in the Northern Territory. If you're planning a trip here for its natural beauty alone, don't forget about all the amazing things going on around it. There are tours available at any time during your stay. Number 10. Otway Forest National Park Brother We Need Otway Forest National Park is a protected area in the Australian state of Victoria. It is located in the Otway Ranges and is one of the most popular national parks in Victoria. The park protects a large region of remnant vegetation from ancient Australian rainforests, which were once home to many unique plants and animals that are now extinct elsewhere. The park was established as an official reserve by Governor Simon Fraser following his visit to Port Ferry in 1827. In 1940, it was granted national park status by King George VII. That's all in today's video. Thanks for watching. Write down in the comments which among the 10 places you would like to visit on your next trip to Australia. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel on your way out 
and we'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace.